It's just an egg. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back. You guys know what it is. Uh, and look, I'm your host, Beaker. We got my pets, Melly and Pie up there. And if you look above them, I mean, we all knew this was going to happen someday, right? Either a new hero or new hero pets or both. Guys, we got all new hero pets. Can we get a round of applause? They're right in front of us here. Now, here's the thing, guys. I saw these. We we all saw these when we were in Finland about a week and a half ago, two weeks ago. But I still don't fully get some of them, especially the Phoenix. But guys, right here, we got Frosty. What's up, Frosty? We got Diggy. We got the Phoenix. And we got the poison lizard. We're going to show you. We're going to show you the pet house. And then we're going to go take these things for a spin. Because these, I think a lot of these are going to be even better than the OG hero pets. The pet house now has to be leveled up to level 8. So, you know, it's like starting all over again. We have to go all the way up if you want to get all these. Especially if you want to get the phoenix. So guys, before we go and actually attack with these things. Let me just show you what they actually do. It's kind of self-explanatory like we said. Frosty spawns frost mites. It's going to be sick. Diggy goes underground, comes up, and smashes and stuns defenses. That one's pretty cool. Poison Lizard is just like you would expect. Poison's stuff, and he's a lizard. And the Phoenix. I don't even understand it, but it brings your hero back to life? Like, like that's what a Phoenix does, right? Hatches to give her hero a final moment of invulnerability. That's going to be too good. That's going to be too good. All right, guys, so before we get into the actual, like, big-time raids, doing all of these heroes with troops, with, with the new hero pets... Let me go in here just one-on-one, -on -one, right? Let's take Frosty. What's up, buddy? Let's see what you do. Oh, man, that was sick. Okay, so that stubby archer tower, the small one, it, it shoots really fast. That's the strength of it. Slowed it down so much. I mean, it definitely ices up. It, that's the point. It's super simple. They took, like, a Yeti Mite, the idea of a Yeti Mite, or, or even, you know, the spirits from Clash Royale, and just made it into a nice one. I love it. Next up, guys, let's check out Diggy. Here we go. Dude, Diggy goes underground. So he's like a miner, but when he pops up, he has the stun ability. This seems like something straight out of like, well, this is pretty common in the Clash universe, but I feel like you would see this in Clash Royale, for sure. Not a lot of things in Clash of Clans stun a building like that. It's pretty cool. Oh, I guess the Builder Base has that with the hog gliders. Either way, pretty cool. All right, so let's hit the ability. I don't think Diggy is going to stand up very well against clan castle troops, but he could. And I actually saw in the notes, Diggy, if your hero dies, he can just dip over to another hero. Yeah, guys, if you look at the bottom there, if his hero is taken out, he'll seek out a new one. I mean, some hero pets do that, but it seems like this one is focused on that. I love it. Next up, guys, is one that I don't even know which hero I want to put him on, but I think he'll probably work on the warden. Poison Lizard. Oh, dude is fast. You're kidding me? Okay, so he's going to do really well against the Clan Castle troops and heroes, right? I guess we'll see. He's going to die. It's okay. We'll use the ability. It's okay. All right, stay up, dude. Stay up, stay up. Oh, he's still going to go down. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. What if we just take the Poison Lizard? You know, we got him on the king right now. What if we just take that dude and go up against every defending hero? Now, we're going to have to keep him alive, so we got to distract. But, I mean, that's easy enough. I don't know, man. It seems like he doesn't... Like, in no way does he kill a hero as fast as a, as a headhunter. But it's still pretty fast. That's incredible, dude. And the barbs definitely help. But I think the poison... That's where it's at, dude. That's where it's at. All right, guys. And that leaves us with the last, but certainly not least. I mean, I think this one might be the best one we're about to see i shut off the thing that turns you know, you know there's that thing in the settings that automatically hits your hero ability i shut that off because when the queen dies the phoenix egg is going to keep her alive we got to see this we got to see this and actually just to just to show the whole thing let me hit the ability right now then she's gonna die again and you'll see she won't die that's that's not gonna be good for her health though <laughs> that's not gonna be good okay She's still alive. Okay. In that situation, she was dead no matter what. But can you imagine if she was on the town hall, right? And all you needed was that extra five, six, seven seconds, whatever it was. And he, and he does damage too. I like that. I, I like this right here. It's like a mini dragon. I was thinking, what if we could take out the, the golden dragon now with just the queen, right? I'm talking the queen ability and the phoenix ability. 
Is that going to be enough for her to, to kill it? It's going to be so close. It's going to be so close. Closer than she has any right to be. I mean, you can't do that solo. Wow. All right, guys. So for our first and possibly only serious attack of the day, I wanted to go in here with the hero pets. It's all about the hero pets, but we do have an army here. I think it's going to be sick. Like, we got a new level of miner. We got a new level of wall breaker, right? Like, a lot of this stuff is just, it's going to help a lot when we get the new town hall. But hey, you see I got the poison lizard on the king. What if we can just bomb in here, hit the king ability, and just take out all these heroes? I mean, I'm not saying it's going to work, but it might. Let's do a queen walk first. Let's start right over here. What's good? What's good? Healer's down. But having the phoenix on the queen is so goofy. There it is. There it is. It's just an egg. It does nothing. I think that might be the drawback of this hero pet. It does nothing until it hits its ability. Whereas, you know, any other hero pet does a lot of stuff. It's always shooting stuff for you, which is great. Okay, King. Oh, dude, I got no idea. Is he going? I can't even see. Can you guys see the lizard? I think he might have went down, dude. I can't see him. If he's in there. Has anybody seen the lizard? A few moments later. He's in there. Oh my, he's behind the king. He's been killing heroes the entire time. And I kind of forgot about my queen. I wasn't even paying attention to her. Can't. I can't stop myself from doing this. I'm getting distracted again. Watch the chain lightning on that. That's going to look so good. That's so sick. It hit all four buildings, right? That was perfect. That's perfect. Love it. All right, let's get the queen in there. Another balloon. I'm just wasting balloons over here. It's all good. There's the queen walk, and that's the super queen walk. We got the egg with her, the egg walk, right? That's going to be really good. I think it's going to be good for, you know, it's like noob insurance for a person like me. And maybe for pros as well. I don't know. If you absolutely need your queen to get to the town hall. Yeah. Yeah, when you think about it that way. If, if your entire raid is setting on the fact that you got to get to the town hall. You got to queen walk to the town hall. Oh, it just happened. Now I can hit the queen ability, right? And make it... That's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. I'm, I'm still messing up. Like, I'm still... I should be way more concentrated here. But hey, let's drop these down here because I want to do the king. One drop that. Couple of miners, couple of hoggos. Let's get that uh, champion down. And the rest... Oh, what a mess, dude. What a mess. King ability. I got no idea if the lizard is still in there. He, he is. He's right there. Well, man, I don't think... I, I mean... I really think it's going to take a while to get used to anything in Town Hall 15. And I've heard a lot of people say the Town Hall 14 was the easy Town Hall. I mean, you know, each their own. If it wasn't easy for you, I don't disagree with you because it's still, unless you were completely maxed, and even then, nothing is easy. But I do think you had a lot of offense. Man, that was sad watching him, like, die and roll over. That was really sad. I do think you had a lot of offense at Town Hall 14. You really did. You suddenly got the hero pets. You got all this high level stuff. Uh, heroes in general were so high level. And then you get to tunnel 15 and suddenly defenses got a big boost. There's new defenses. There's new levels defenses, but we still haven't seen everything. Anyway, man, thank you for coming out today. We love you guys. If you enjoyed this one, be sure to let us know in the comments below. If you like one of these, I think a lot of people are going to like the Phoenix, the idea of it. But to be honest, I think Frosty or Diggy, they're my dudes. You guys know how had a duck named Diggy? Literally, that was his name because he would dig in the ground for worms and stuff. So Diggy, same with our dude here, except he's like an armadillo or something. What is he? Yeah, he's like some sort of reptile. Cool, cool. Hey, and don't forget, these things are going to be so expensive. So I think I might have said in the beginning, but get your loot ready because I think they're going to be like at the max levels. These these pets are going to be over 300,000. Cool. But the good news is we can now hold 370,000. I like that. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow for more sneak peeks. Cool. Tune in then, guys. Same, same time, same place. You know what it is. Peace.